Okay, Axis Allies Global just finished round seven. 1942 setup. Just want to give you an overview of what the board looks like. Oh boy, look at that. Very interesting. Okay, well, I just got the confirmation that Germany will attack Moscow this upcoming turn, which will be turn eight. That is a lot of German tanks. 30 tanks there, plus three will be coming from Ukraine. 33 total. Well, Russia has a lot of stuff too, so as you can see, both armies are huge. I believe the Germans have an edge though. But it's going to be pretty close, so we'll see what happens. That's going to be the big battle of uh, this upcoming turn. Uh, the Germans have started to build some men on the Western Front. Not much, though, as you can imagine. Everything's still going to the Eastern Front because the Allies really haven't done much here on the Western Front. They're still just concentrating on the Mediterranean. They haven't gone to Normandy. Probably a blunder on the Allies, not putting pressure on the Germans there. Um, so, you know... When you play these games, you, uh, you learn a lot, so they had to be quicker, but if Russia does fall, I'll probably put the blame on the Western Allies for not going into Normandy earlier or securing Gibraltar, which was kind of a disaster, as you know, from the previous videos. Um, Italy has really dwindled in Africa. Not much left, as you can imagine. They're just trying to hold out um, off Italy with a decent navy. If the Allies attack, um, Italy... Probably has the edge because it's scramble, so that's good for the Axis. So we'll see how long they can hold out there. Uh, the Western Allies continue to pour in Africa, adding ships to the Mediterranean. Um, eventually, they're going to overpower the Axis in Africa, obviously. Britain using that factory in Iraq and trying to send as much equipment as possible uh, quickly to Russia for aid, but it's not going to arrive before Germany attacks. India is still holding out, it's good for the Allies. Um, Japan has kind of thinned out in the Asian continent, you know, just a few infantry and artillery, not much as you can see. Uh, I think they're overspread, that's a problem because now they're trying to go deeper in the, in the uh, India with, with all those mechs, hopefully maybe attack next round India. We'll see what the Japanese uh, do. Problem is they're facing this big Allied fleet which has now moved into uh, New Guinea, Dutch New Guinea, and is threatening these islands, so uh, Japan may have to pull out of the Philippine Sea. I don't know if they can hold off that huge allied fleet. Uh, we'll see what happens with the Yanks do this upcoming turn. So, uh, like we always have uh, said, or at least I have said, the Allies, I think, are definitely winning the Pacific War, at least the Naval War. Uh, India is still around. Um, the Axis are definitely winning on this side of the board. Germans take Moscow. They still need to get one more victory city. It's probably going to be Egypt. Um, if Germany does take Moscow, they'll transfer all that equipment to the south. So uh, we'll see if the Allies can respond before that stuff comes to Egypt. But, you know, Russia still has a legitimate chance of holding. We'll see. They do have a lot of stuff, but so does Germany. I give the edge to Germany right now, but, you know, anything can happen. We've seen dice go uh, bad for either side. So that's it. Round seven about to start round eight. Deuces.